Let's try to solve this problem. Addition and subtraction of complex numbers. So combine the following complex numbers. Let's start with 1. Quantity 2 plus 3i plus quantity 5 minus 2i. So how do we combine, meaning add and subtract complex numbers? So we just need to combine all the real parts and all the imaginary parts. So to answer number 1, since the two real parts are 2 and 5, we need to add them. 2 plus 5, that will be 7. And then, we also need to combine the imaginary parts, 3i minus 2i, that will be 1i, positive 1i, or simply positive i. So therefore, the answer is 7 plus i. For number 2, we have quantity negative 5 minus 7i minus quantity 4 plus 6i. The operation in between is subtraction. So if that's the case, we can distribute this negative sign or it means it has a coefficient of negative 1 in front of the 4 plus 6i. So we can multiply each term of the complex number by negative 1 first. So we can just copy this negative 5 minus 7i. Then multiplying each term by negative 1. Or all we need to do is to get the opposite sign of each term. So for positive 4, this will become negative 4. And for positive 6i, this will become negative 6i. And then likewise, on the first problem, we just need to combine all the real parts and imaginary parts. So we can combine negative 5 minus 4, that will be negative 9. And then for the imaginary parts, we have negative 7i minus 6i, that will be negative 13i. So this is the final answer. For number 3, we have negative 5 times quantity 8 minus 6i plus 2 times quantity 3 plus i. So notice here that we have an extra coefficient in front of the two complex numbers. So what we can do first is to distribute these two constants in the complex numbers. So for negative 5, let's multiply negative 5 times 8. That's negative 40. The negative 5 times negative 6, that's positive 30i. Then for this positive 2, let's distribute as well here. So 2 times 3, that will be 6. 2 times i, that will be 2i. And then we can combine again the real and imaginary parts. So for the real parts, we can combine negative 40 plus 6, that will be negative 34. For the imaginary parts, let's combine 30i plus 2i, that will be 32i. So therefore, this is the final answer. For number 4, we have 3 times quantity 1 plus 10i minus 7 times quantity negative 2 plus 5i minus quantity negative 4 plus 3i. So let's distribute first this 3, this negative 7, as well as this negative sign here. So for the first complex number, we have 3 times 1, that's 3, plus 3 times 10i, that's 30i. Then negative 7 times negative 2, that's positive 14. Then negative 7 times positive 5i, that's negative 35i. Then let's distribute this negative here. Or simply get the opposite sign of the terms in the complex number. So negative 4 becomes positive 4. Then positive 3i becomes negative 3i. Then we combine all the real parts first. So we have 3, 14, and 4. So 3 plus 14 plus 4. That will be equal to 21. Then for the imaginary parts, we have 30i minus 35i minus 3i. So that's equal to negative 8i. So therefore, the final answer is 21 minus 8i. Okay, so now it's your turn. So try to answer this problem number 5 and just comment your answers.